Hey folks, this is IOE Thurman back with some more World of Tanks. As you can see, this is Extreme Unicorn Attack. And we haven't had a game from him in like six days. So when Extreme sends me a game, I know it's going to be good. So you start with a traffic jam and then you go from there. And so uh, he's in his E50 and this is a tier 10 game on Cliff. Last time we were at Cliff, we were way up there doing stuff up there um, in a little tank. And now we're definitely not going that way. Um, and if you're wondering why Extreme's amazing video is only going to be a Friday, wait till you see tomorrow's video. <laughs> there was a rhyme and reason. Ooh, targets. Nice shot on the move into the Waffen Trigger. Um, but he doesn't want to stay there because, of course, they'll shoot back if he stays there. So by pushing right up here, he get, actually gets onto the enemy's flank. Um, unfortunately, though, this does put him in prime position to be shot by artillery. If he's not paying attention and ducking and weaving. Unfortunately for the enemy uh, medium tanks over here, they're not equipped to deal with him. Not on this terrain, not in this situation. Uh, he can basically poke up whenever he wants to. They're caught in a crossfire between the object 140s over here and himself. And so he's going to be able to farm these guys uh, just pretty much whenever he wants to poke up and fire. Now, if they wanted to kill him, they would all have to rush him at the same time, pretty much at the start of the game. They didn't do that. Uh, if all three of them came rushing in here, then he would be very dead. Um, he might get a kill, but they would clean him out of this area and then be able to be safe to do whatever else they need for the rest of the game. They're not doing that. They're sitting back and they're peeking and they're poking, and by doing that, it just gives Extreme free reign over this section of the map. And he is getting up, he is taking his time, he's aiming his shots. The one shot that went through, went through just above his uh, gun mantle. If it hit his gun mantle, it would not have gone through. Um, and then, you know, artillery hits him, but because he's used his uh, repair already, he needs to wait for it to come up on his own. But during that time, nobody attacks him. He is free to do what he wants, and he is taking full advantage of this. Uh, he's actually expecting an attack to come from the Waffle Trigger side, but that's not, it's just not happening. Uh, they either don't care that he's over here, um, or don't see any reason to do anything about it. Uh, and so, I mean, he's up to almost 4,000 damage just by getting into the spot and being able to stay here because the enemy haven't bothered to get him out. He's killed, well, he's basically killed three guys. He actually killed one of them. The other one died to, I think they packed themselves in too tight and he died to friendly collision. And the last one finally realizes he's gotta go and just get, gets up there, but too little, too late, and he dies in the process. However, the Waffen Trigger grill combination is very bad for us. The problem is that the grills, again, are stopping. They're not moving forward, and they're stopping in a really unfortunate place for them because they're just going to get farmed by our TDs in that spot. And so, well, that's exactly what's happening. And we're getting spine damage off some of it. Um, but some of it, they're close enough to spot for themselves, so we don't get any of that. That's perfectly fine. Enemy team has fallen really quickly. And most of it is because of the fact that they didn't bother digging out uh, Extreme until way too late in the game. And even then, they didn't really dig him out because he's still here. In the, pretty much the same spot he started the map in. And still dominating this region of the map. Uh, he's up to almost 7,000 damage, and there hasn't been any real amazing strategy in any of it, except for the fact that he is going where he knows he needs to go, um, where no one else on his team has gone, and he's taking advantage of the fact that the enemy teams and pubs tend to hesitate. They tend to not be really uh, snappy on their decisions. Um, and so, taking advantage of that, he's just going where he knows he can take advantage, and then letting them, you know, he's basically farming them after they're letting him farm them. 
He does get up to six kills uh, through a little bit of, you know, holding fire until friendlies have hit things and stuff. But um, perfectly fine game. And yes, he's firing standard ammo. This is the gold ammo. So um, he didn't fire a single drop of gold ammo that game. Could have fired some HE. I don't think he did, though. Um, and just won this through sheer... Surely being in the right place and then taking advantage of being in the right place while the enemy team hesitated. And that is what you cannot do if you're on the other side of this. Oh yeah, let's uh, jump over and see what his battle results were. Ace Tanker, Bruiser, Duelist, Fire for Effect, 5 Bonds, High Caliber, and, a and a Top Gun, sorry. Wow. Um, and I kept going over this again and again. That he was simply taking advantage of the fact the enemy team was hesitating. And they were hesitating because they didn't immediately charge him and come dig him out of that hole. Um, and he was alone most of that game. And because the enemy team hesitated, he won. And he won in the center, which means the rest of his team didn't have to worry about it. And they just cleaned up their sides of the map. And if you can hold the center of that donut on Cliff, you will win the map almost every time. And he does 7,000 damage in the process. He had a great game, but it wasn't anything spectacular. It was just taking advantage of the enemy team doing dumb. And look at this. These guys did very little damage that game. Um, and then... The, well, I guess the AMX, he was almost top of their team on experience. With 700 damage. 800-ish. And then 1,000... Is that negative one? Is that that's because he killed this guy's in it? Who apparently did damage to somebody. I bet they shot each other. <laughs> so yeah. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> this was a great game and he made a ton of cash off it. He wouldn't have made money even if he'd been running a premium account without the action payoff. He still would have made money on this game. And that is a sign of a great game. So thank you very much, uh, Extreme, for sending this in. Thank you all for watching. And I'm pretty sure there's going to be a bonus clip, but I'm, I have to go find one first. So if it turns out there isn't one, I'm sorry. But there really should be one. So I'll see you then. This is IOE Threat.